Hey everyone, welcome back to a new video. So for today's video, I am going to be doing something different. I am going to be cooking. I will be making pot roast in the crock pot. So if you want to see how I do that, then just keep watching. Okay, so I have my uh, roast right here. I'm just going to sear it. And then I have half of an onion, uh, six cloves of garlic, this Goya Sazon con cilantro y achote. And then what I have in here is like a pot roast packet. This is what it looks like. I already used it, but it says slow cooker right here and then it says pot roast. So you want to buy one of these and then empty the contents into... I have it in this thing because um, it's supposed to have one cup of water. So I just measured one cup of water. And then I also have Greek, Italiano, and the steak seasoning, parsley. I'm using soy sauce because I ran out of salsa inglesa. I don't know how to say salsa inglesa in English, um, but I will write it down here. And then I have this Laurie's uh, seasoning salt, some pepper, and garlic powder. And then there's one more ingredient that I use. Pineapple vinegar that my mom made. I don't know how to make it. I don't know how to, um, like if it even exists to buy in the store. But it's really good. You don't need to add it, but I just love the way it tastes on meat. Okay, so I'm just going to put this on to like a higher settings. I'm just going to sear the meat. So what this does is it helps release a lot of the blood before putting it into that crock pot bowl. I don't add oil or water because I feel like it releases a lot of water anyway and it's oils. The little bit of water that you saw already on the pan was because I rinsed the meat. Okay, so I had to um, add the meat in here and finish searing it off camera because it was really hard to hold uh, the camera while doing it. So now I'm just going to pour the um, pot roast mix. The six cloves of garlic. Make sure that you don't eat the garlics because, um, like when it's done, because they taste really, really bitter. And I'm gonna add this um, achote. I don't measure ever, so I just add what makes sense to me. That was the Greek, and I'm gonna add the keg seasoning. The Italiano. The parsley. the garlic seasoning and that was the black pepper okay so while I while I had the meat searing and I was preparing this I already had this on the highest setting and you're going to want to cook it for 8 hours and I will see you guys uh, once it's done to show you what it looks like and for the taste test. Okay, so much much hours later my food is finally complete, the pot roast. This is what the final product looks like. Um, this is the pot roast that we made. These are I just paired it up with brown rice and potatoes. Um, but now for the taste test. I feel so weird doing this. 
and I'm gonna do a taste test for you guys. Mmm. It's really, really good. 10 out of 10 for sure. You guys have to try this recipe. It's actually really good. Alright, so that will conclude today's video and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.